All three of us unanimously felt compassion first responders pay for homeless, disabled women's hotel too. First responders went above and beyond to help a homeless, disabled woman and her dog stuck in the rain and paid out of their own pockets to check the two into a hotel and make sure they'd be safe and dry. The fire station 37 crew responded to a 911 dispatch about a woman complaining of foot pain at about 2 a.m. on Tuesday in Lauderdale Lakes, a city in Broward County, Florida. However, what, according to Daniel Rodriguez of the fire station 37 crew, the woman had upwards of 10 bags and boxes of personal belongings. She shared an emote, the crew tried to check all the boxes and go through the proper route by reaching out to appropriate shelters and programs that may be able to help the woman with continued assistance, but it was to no avail. We contacted Broward Sheriff's Office about a homeless outreach program we have, but that's only 9 a.m. 5 p.m., the trio already knew that they had to get her someplace safe. It was raining, the crew called local hotels to search for a place for the night, and asked the woman to point out the necessities and sentimental items she needed before they moved her. We got her on the stretcher and she told us which items to grab for her, Rodriguez recounts. Once they arrived, we've never felt like this you all three of us unanimously felt compassion for this lady, says Rodriguez. She was very appreciative. The crew gave the woman contact numbers and information about local shelters for assistance, and while it is uncertain where she is now, she said that her brother was expected to come and help her out the next day. Rodriguez attributes the selfless gesture to the feeling they get when they go back to the station and know that they impacted someone's life. District Chief Ken Kronheim tells Yahoo Lifestyle that this isn't out of the ordinary for the team at Broward. That's kind of how